I'm gonna go get that ja chow egg now then, in that case. Like, this is the right way, right? Whoops! Um, no it's not. <laughs> My bad. Uh, so we just entered the second stage of uh, Amy's story. Um, that's okay. I think we can uh, do the next part after it as well. Uh, so yeah, once again, uh, gonna be on the run from the evil robot. Okay, let's turn it the wrong way. So we need to uh, get through this stage and watch out for the robot along the way. So the interesting thing about Hot Shelter, and I'll go ahead and say this now, um, I guess you could kind of call this a spoiler a little bit, but um... None of the remaining three characters, uh, none of them get to do the Sky Deck level. So Amy won't do Sky Deck, uh, Big the Cat won't do Sky Deck, and neither will uh, Gamma when we get to his story. Uh, but they do get the Hot Shelter level, which is this level. Uh, this is the only level we haven't seen yet, actually. Because um, Sonic has every level except Hot Shelter. And he has Sky Deck instead of Hot Shelter. So, that's why we've never seen this level yet, is that the secondary characters are the only one that actually has this level in particular. And it's kind of interesting. This is actually a very interesting level. Just in terms of its uh, design and whatnot. Also, I fell in the water. I shouldn't have done that. This being the hot shelter, the water is probably really, really hot. And I... Oh my god. Yeah, this is why kind of using Amy sometimes is a little frustrating, just because, yeah, the platforming with her can be kind of awkward. Because, like, I, I definitely pressed the jump button right there. It just didn't activate. And then you have to make kind of two jumps like this, too. You have to do all this, like, slow like lever pulling as well just a just a very weird level also I apparently did that uh, um, turning puzzle wrong oh well it is what it is ah uh, freaking zero leave me alone Jesus Zero definitely has some interesting attacks. Oh, right, this. I remember this. I think you can, like, move this staircase. A moving ladder. Please return it to its original position after using it. Okay, so. Yeah, you can just push the staircase. Why? Because why not? Jeez. <laughs> that robot is definitely bad news. No! Leave me alone, don't shoot me. supposed to be like your captain. My god! I couldn't get off that spinning wheel, so that's what kind of screwed me up right there. Okay, no. I came through this way. That's right. Die. Again. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. There we go. Come on, I jumped. God, why is it so awkward to move as her? Seriously. Okay, I made it back to this part. There we go. 
Let me at least grab this checkpoint so I can actually continue. All oh, right, I have to go on the spinning wheel. I believe this level is, funnily enough, the longest level in Amy's playthrough. But you wouldn't think that, because, like I said before, her story has three levels, but this is the uh, gauntlet of her playthrough. I always find the last level is, like, just extremely short for some reason. I don't know what it is or why it is that way, it just is. Be careful. Yeah, I've already fallen off a few times as it is, so that's probably some really good advice. <laughs> Man, the angle is so weird there, too. Okay, he's climbing the staircase, too. That's just weird. Okay, so here's the main gimmick of this level for Amy. You have to grab these blocks, and you have to place them in the, uh, colored compartments. Grab it. You got red. And now, we have blue. Blue boys! And with that, oh god. That's not the TV show we wanted to watch. <laughs> the only other option was Big Comfy Couch. Never mind, the Zero Show is fine. <laughs> Wait, uh, okay, there we go. Jeez, even N64 control stick spinning is better than this. <laughs> and this is a better controller, too. It's just awkward with how the game registers it, I guess. So now we're going to have Zero shooting at us while we're trying to solve the puzzle. It's like, you know, you could wait till we're done. Illogical. I'm trying to destroy you. You're trying to escape. <laughs> How dumb do you think I am? <laughs> well, now that you mention it. <laughs> okay, so where's the last... Oh, it's over here. Thank God. Falling off is the last thing I would have wanted to do right there. Can't even see... Oh, wow, not even close to where the frickin' switch was, Amy. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Well, thankfully, I think that's the end of the level, so we're good. Look at all these monkeys in here. Let's get away from them as soon as possible. Oh, yay. Wow, the monkeys are killing themselves. That's just mean. <laughs> okay, well, that took seven minutes, but, uh, well, that's normal for that level. Cue the bizarre cutscene world. <laughs> I gotta say, Amy's facial expressions are actually pretty funny. 
I don't know why, I just find them hilarious. So, th this is weird. I know that it put me in the other room, but I know there's one cutscene, or one section of this, where you're supposed to go this way even though it starts you in the other room. And yeah, this is that one. I don't know why it does that. Was that chaos? I think it was. That's creepy. Let's never see that again. <laughs> Gee, what was that? I wonder if I'm dreaming. Oh my, I need to get out of this place. I don't know. This place looks pretty nice. You're in a pool. You have a problem with pools, Amy? Are you a poolist? Poolist not even being a word? Made it up just a few seconds ago. Where do you think you're going, Amy? Eggman, no! You can't get away this easily. It's a Chaos Emerald! What? I don't need you when I've got this! Gamma! At your service, sir. Amy? That's one of Eggman's clunkers! Out of my way! No! He helped me before by letting me escape! This robot is different! You don't need to hurt him, okay? Amy! Okay, I guess I'll let him go then. We're fresh out of time. Take Amy and clear out fast. What about you? I'll nail that Eggman. Can't let him escape. I knew you would save me, Sonic. You're my hero. Uh, you okay? It's dangerous here. Don't pay attention to Eggman anymore! Free yourself! Come on! Why are you helping me? I said we'd be friends, and I'm returning your favor! Even this birdie wants you to be free! Eggman's not the kind of man you should work for! Amy, come on! Let's get going!
they were after you, my feathered friend. Hey, a pendant! Wow! So I'll help you find your family. Does Eggman have them captive now? Find your family? I've come this far. I may as well go all the way. That robot said Dr. Eggman's base is in the Mystic Ruin. So what do you say we check it out? No! I don't want to check it out yet. I have an idea. I have ideas. <laughs> Okay, so I'm actually okay. I'm actually kind of glad we have this. Um, there are two ways you can get back to the egg carrier at this point. Um, there's actually like two boats you can use to get there. Uh, one's in Station Square. It's in the first area. I just go to the water shoreline and you'll find it. Uh, the other one, I believe, is just through here. This raft. And if you ride this raft, uh, it'll take you to the egg carrier. Uh, we're not supposed to be here, even though we will end up here anyway. Uh, but the reason why I'm back here is I want to get the other upgrade. I want to talk about the two hammer hedgehog emblems. I might just go ahead and take care of them while I'm here anyway. And then I also want to get the uh, chow egg as well. So I need to make my way back to that one room, which I believe... It's not too hard to get to it. I think we can just go down here and take the monorail, I think. Yeah, I think we can take the monorail. <laughs> monorail. <laughs> monorail. I think we can anyway. Either way, <clears throat> this is not too bad because... I guess this way I can kind of show off the way you kind of navigate the egg carrier once it's down. Because it can be a little confusing and it was really hard to uh, get all the emblems that were on the egg carrier just because of how confusing it can kind of be uh, just due to the nature of this ship. Uh, but basically, I think this is where we want to be. One of these is the engine room, which I guess not this. Maybe I can't even access the engine room right now. I'll, uh, I'll check it out over here first before I do anything. Okay, yeah, this is the pool room. Okay, I guess with Amy you can't access the engine room. Uh, but the engine room is uh, through this door over here, I believe. And basically, it's that room with the chair, and you have to move the chair to step on the button to change the ship shape. Uh, if you go in this room... Uh, you'll see that button, and if you press it, you'll change the formation of the ship. It won't show you a cutscene of it, uh, just because, um, well, it's not flying in the air anymore, so a cutscene would be kind of weird anyway. But um, that's how you change the ship, from the uh, extended wings to non-extended wings. And that's basically what you do to uh, kind of... Um, navigate the ship because there are some em emblems you can only get when the ship is in a certain shape and uh, yeah just, that's something you gotta keep in mind when you're going emblem hunting uh, but yeah I am back in the uh, jail cell this is where uh, we were here's the last chow egg I am gonna post the poll one more time in this video description i uh, just going to remind you guys that uh, you guys, if you want to go to the straw poll in the video, des uh, video description, you can vote on which chow I'll be using to get the chow emblems. So there are a couple of chow emblems we'll have to get, and you're voting on whether you want me to use the gold chow, the silver chow, or the black chow. Although to be specific, I think this is supposed to be a uh, like a monotone chow. Or monochrome. Well, maybe not monochrome, but... You know, not, like... Black is probably not the right classification, but... Yeah. So, in the straw poll, you're voting for which of the chow you want me to use for the chow emblems. 
whenever I get around to that because that'll take a lot of grinding and I'm not gonna show all of that grinding on camera because well, I don't want it to take a ridiculously long time, and I think that's fair. Okay, so let's go ahead, break it open. There's our Chow. Aw, oh, he's cute. Okay. That's all we have to do here. So let's uh, let's go back to the Hedgehog Hammer Room. There we go, that should, that should be enough. Okay, so this will give us our second upgrade, and the final upgrade too, so there's not any other upgrades. But we get the long hammer. Here's the long hammer. Your attack radius is now increased. Try the spin hammer attack. <laughs> 